Okay, okay, we're gonna make a little video here. This is the air conditioner. It's wired up to the 110 circuit. Got a uh, lock handle in that door in case we need to get in and out of there. This is just hooked up to the 110, just a pass-through connector. Run it through an extension cord over here to the little generator. 2200 watts. That's about as loud as it gets. Flag pole, just an aluminum rod screwed right into the frame. The door, just some local, well, that's not local, but local decorations. Got my pickup tool there. This little homemade step out of. Uh, leftover wood, little toolbox cooker, we come in, we got our power system, 12 volt battery, power inverter, battery charger just in case, our water pump system, running off of two 7 gallon jugs, powers up our sink, and our water heater over here, into our shower makeshift bathroom toilet and then these cabinets got from Amazon just screwed right onto the wall 2x4 construction bar type sink a little stove we're gonna try tonight we got one 110 outlet there and the other one is over here just above the fridge Charging up our jump box in case we might need that. Refrigerator runs very well off of the little generator. Fold up table right here. Our power center. A plane flying by. This one works the lights. They uh, brighten dim off this little switch here. And this one works the water pump. And then the air conditioner mounted through the wall on the back door and that's the, the pass throughs down there for the electrical circuit and one window this is our twin bed area I have to use a CPAP machine I've got that wired into the power inverter it runs off the battery just in case generator runs out of gas in the middle of the night I ain't got to worry about it so haven't finished the roof yet I'm trying to come up with a unique design but there it is